Okay guys, here's a really quick and easy tutorial on how to install Kino for CarX Drift, okay? Uh, the links will be in the description, all right? So you're gonna get the GitHub link, and it's for Kino, you're just gonna click the download here, and then you're gonna click this one right here. It's gonna download, top right. When it's done, you're gonna click it to open it. Okay, it's a, it's a zip file, but you don't even need to unzip it. Just click it once, open it, and you'll have these two files. When that's done, you're gonna to go to your Steam, and you're gonna right click your CarX Drift Racing Online. You're gonna to go to Properties first. You're gonna to go to Betas. You're gonna hit the drop down right here. And you're gonna click Modable, Public Modable Branch. Okay, once you click that, just close this. You'll notice it's starting to download something for the game, it's updating. That's good. Now we wait. Almost done. Now that it's done, you're going to right click it one more time, hover over manage and browse local files. With this open, you're going to take the two Kino files you just got. You're going to drag and drop these here. I already have them here, so I don't need to do this. So once that's done, you can close this, click play. Now check this out. This is where it's this is where it gets really cool. Just wait for it. Just wait for it. When it launches at the top, you'll be greeted with a whole new slew of things. Well, it's that I mean you'll see. If the game ever wants to open. There we go. Boom. See? Boom. Yeah, I, I didn't get you KSL. You probably, yeah, you, you'll probably be fine without it. But yeah, that's it.